Wildcats advance to 4-0 before they head to Anaheim for the Wooden Legacy. Caleb, it's a little bit of a slowdown affair. Talk about how difficult that is to defend the style that you played against. Um, you know, it was kind of an ugly, ugly game all around. I mean, offensively, it kind of took us out of our rhythm. You know, we were missing some easy shots. I know me personally, I missed a lot of easy shots tonight. Um, you know, it's kind of, kind of one of those wins that's, it's, it's, it's a win, but it doesn't feel like a win in some aspects. And I think we, uh, we were definitely a little out of sync. Um, you know, we got, we got three games coming up in, uh, in uh, L.A. and uh, kind of an opportunity to bounce back. We didn't see it a lot last year, but you and Dusan on the floor at the same time. Describe what that offense and defensive outlook looks for the two seven-footers. Um, you know, I think it's good. Uh, you know, obviously me playing four and, and having him out at the five, I think we get a lot of rebounds. And, um, you know, it's a little di different dynamic. Um, you know, obviously it's a matter of me not fouling at the four and, and uh, you know, obviously kind of, you know, staying in rhythm and sync on offense. Um, and I think it's going to, you know, we take it one game at a time. And I think, you know, as the season goes on, we'll get a little more comfortable with that. Um, but we work on it a lot in practice, and, and we kind of have a good dynamic out there. It's still very early on in the season. A lot of people don't think of it this way, but without T.J. McConnell the last two years, are you guys still trying to get used to playing with Parker and Kadeem at the point? Um, you know, I think we're, we're kind of getting used to playing with everyone just together on the court. You know, we lost a lot of guys last year. We got a lot of new people, you know, incoming freshmen, a lot of transfers. Um, you know, I think, like I said, we take it one, one game at a time. You know, sometimes it's a little uglier than other, but, um, you know, we uh, – you know, we learn from every every game, every situation, and, and uh, you know, the sky's the limit for us. I think we're getting better every game, and that's that's really what's important. Looking ahead to this weekend, you've played in these types of affairs most recently in Maui with the three games in three days. What are you looking forward to this weekend? Um, you know, these are these are tough tournaments. You know, especially you know having back to back. You know, sometimes back to back to back games. Um, you know, you only have you know less than 24 hours to prepare for the next game, and um, you know it's really just about you know everyone treating it like a business trip and, and going out there and, and being prepared, being ready, um, you know, taking care of ourselves, and um, you know we've we've done pretty pretty well at these tournaments since I've been here, and and uh, hopefully continue that this year. All right, thanks, Caleb. Thank you. Wildcats roll on to four wins to start the season. They're on to Anaheim, California. Eat your turkey. Watch the Wildcats.